Bosha and welcome to a new series on my channel called Meet the Characters. As you all know, I am creating a Star Wars book and I'd like to you guys a few of the characters so you can sort of get a grasp on who is what, what's going to be going on, and how the book is going to turn out. To start off, I do want to say this book takes place between Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi, and Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. And we have a plethora of juicy characters, but we also have a finite amount of main characters. Now the approach with this book that I am taking is kind of like a real world perspective type beat that we all need to kind of remember and understand. And that every character is the main character in their own mind now we're gonna have a main character in our story but every character needs to be written and needs to live like they are their own main character because everybody is their own main character in their world in their perspective now this is going to be a five part series for meeting the characters as we do have five characters in total and i'm very excited for this one so make sure to drop a like if we could hit 10 likes on this video i will drop the next meet the character as soon as possible if you guys want that video out on the 4th of july give me 10 likes on this video and i'll get you guys that next video tomorrow so here we go the first edition of meet the character and i'm very excited for this one i'm gonna splash up some art that i've done myself for these characters as it comes so the first character in question her name is rena tano when we meet her in the book she's going to be 10 years old her species is tagruda and a little bit of background on rena Rena is a Tagruta female who has experienced a lot of challenges in her life on her home planet and her parents were indeed taken in as slaves. She was forced to endure the cruelty of the slavers and their owners until a certain tragedy struck. but. Rena possesses a brazen and determined spirit and she has developed a survival mechanism during her time as a lone child on her home planet. She has a natural introverted nature, likely as a result of her early life's hardships and the unfortunate tragedies that she has had to endure. Her experiences have made her fiercely independent but she also cherishes the few meaningful connections that she has made. A uh, few strengths and talents of Arena. Uh, despite her young age, Arena is incredibly talented. She possesses a strong connection and it allows her to perform feats that surpass her years of training. Her intuition and ability to sense the emotions and intentions of others make her quite adept to navigating difficult situations she's naturally gifted and she displays an impressive level of skill for someone her age um, and while people have strengths they also have weaknesses and whilst she is undeniably gifted she possesses a massive struggle with discipline and focus she finds it really challenging to maintain a consistent work ethic which has been a significant hurdle in her journey her independent nature sometimes leads her to resist traditional teachings and this causes tensions with her and her superiors um, her role model is Ahsoka Tano and she was deeply inspired by Ahsoka Tano for her courage and her strength. And although they are not blood related, Rena did take the 
Tano name as a sign of respect and gratitude. Ahsoka became her role model and her mentor, guiding her through the early stages of her training and pretty much just helping her get to where we're at when we meet her in the book. It's very, very cool. Her best friend is Nathan. Nathan is our main character. And if you guys want to learn more about Nathan, we need 10 likes on this video. She storms us. She forms a strong bond with Nathan. And like Nathan, Rena has been through so much in her life. And that kind of helps them create this immediate connection. They find solace in each other's company. And they provide each other tons and tons of support as they make their way through the tumultuous journey called life. And as she continues to grow, learn, and develop as an individual, her unique background and determination will set her on a path to become a formidable, good person in the galaxy. Rina Tano is maybe, maybe my favorite character that I've that I've created and I'm very excited to share more and more and more with you guys about this so if we can get a mad 10 likes on this video I'll share some more about Rena through our main character Nathan and we'll drop that video tomorrow I'm really excited for this series I'm really excited to share with you guys about my book and if there's anything in particular that you want to know, any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. With that all being said, it has been your boy Sotiko. And I do appreciate each and every single one of you. If you guys are interested in anything to do with my book, you can hit me up on Twitter. You can join the Discord or, of course, you can leave a comment in the comment section. But I'm going to try and be as transparent with this as possible. Keep you guys involved. And good things are a coming. I'm thinking about doing a concept art stream on Twitch. If you guys would be interested in watching me design some characters, create some art, do a madness, let me know in the comments. I would be very interested in doing so. We're going to be streaming live tonight in about 50 minutes from when i'm recording this but at 5 p.m pacific we're going to be on twitch.tv having some fun playing some games maybe working on my book so with that all being said it has been your boy so tico i do appreciate each and every single one of you and above all else guys make sure to stay safe tell your mother that you love her with peace knowledge and serenity may the force be with you because i am out peace I can't try, wake up, I'm wasting still Realize the time